Sam Bunch from Clapham will self-publish her first book, Collecting Conversations, in March. When my mum died in 2007 and then two years later my dad died, I was a bit stuck. Serendipitous happenings basically took me to go to her diaries for inspiration and then decided that if she's the, the main woman in my life is not here anymore, let's get inspiration from women that are still here. So I decided to give myself a challenge and interview 100 women about how they do life based around what my mum spoke about in her diaries. My mum talked about the weather every single page of her diaries, um, mainly because she lived in the North West, it rained all the time. Um, and I thought the weather is such a mundane, ordinary thing and we all talk about it but do we acknowledge that we talk about it? As you progress in a conversation, I just got, I went from the, the light and fluffy and the superfluous to more serious and, and, and more in depth, I suppose. Never in a million years did I think I'd ever write a book. Not interested in writing, can't spell, can't punctuate. Um, not really got the patience, to be honest. I'm much more of a chatter. I came to London in 1987. Um, having failed abysmally at my A-levels and thought, shit, now what am I going to do? I got myself a temp job in a law firm and then the law firm offered me a full-time job as a paralegal, um, which I was unqualified for but took with gusto, thank you very much. Ended up living in Clapham with three friends from the north and basically that's it. I never moved out of Clapham since. The beauty of London is... Um, just by default you have everybody from around the world it's amazing it's a melting pot of loveliness people are my thing some people it's animals and whatever for me it's people it's not about interest it's about every single person's got a story nobody is better than anybody else in my opinion the amount of people say oh you don't want to talk to me i've got nothing to say i'm boring it's rubbish it's absolute rubbish because when you actually have a heartfelt open conversation with anybody at all if you're listening they'll talk yeah i think I'll probably carry on doing it till the day I drop dead, to be honest.